Hello, this is Peter Rogers with the National Weather Service in Sioux Falls with a winter storm briefing for Friday, December 27, 2019. We are expecting a complex winter storm with significant snow, rain, and freezing rain accumulations across the region. This will impact large portions of Wyoming, Nebraska, South Dakota, North Dakota, and Minnesota, beginning tonight and continuing through the weekend and into Sunday. Travel will become difficult if not hazardous across a large portion of the region through Sunday. Looking at the timing of precipitation, it is expected to lift northward in the South Dakota later tonight as a mixed bag of snow, rain, and freezing rain. That precipitation will continue to lift north in the overnight hours and eventually encompass most of the area during the day on Saturday. Warm temperatures should move into the region on Saturday so that much of the precipitation changes over to all rain. And in some instances, there may be a break in activity during portions of Saturday. As we move into Saturday night into Sunday, the rain pushes off to the east and much colder air filters into the region resulting in snow basically from I-29 westward and continuing through the day on Sunday. Winds are expected to increase dramatically on Sunday, resulting in areas of blowing and drifting snow and near whiteout conditions at times. When all is said and done, when we're looking at snow forecast, we're looking at generally 8 to 12 plus inches from the James River Valley westward and roughly 2 to 8 inches along a tight gradient as you go to the east. Snow rates of 1 inch per hour or more are possible Saturday night into Sunday. Because of the warmer temperatures, this snow will be wet and heavy. Expect roads to become slick and snow covered, making travel difficult if not hazardous. One important thing to note here is because of temperatures being near freezing, there is an area of uncertainty in amounts that stretches roughly from Yankton to Sioux Falls up towards Marshall, and in these areas we'll have to watch carefully as the storm progresses. There is a threat for icing across the region with this system and the greatest threat extends from eastern southeast South Dakota into southwest Minnesota and northwest Iowa with accumulations of roughly a tenth to a quarter of an inch of ice, basically the areas highlighted in dark orange or red. The greatest threat for icing is tonight through Saturday morning and again Saturday evening as rain transitions back to snow. Roads will become slick and ice covered making travel difficult and if the ice does accumulate to a greater depth some breakage of trees and power lines is also possible. As mentioned earlier winds will become quite strong especially Saturday night into Sunday with peak gusts from 30 to 40 miles per hour especially across South Dakota. Impacts will be blowing and drifting snow with even some near whiteout conditions again mainly across South Dakota. In summary, travel will become difficult if not hazardous tonight through Sunday, but there may be that brief break in activity during the day on Saturday as the warmer temperatures move in with most precipitation changing to rain. Significant snow and ice accumulations are expected, so make sure to check road conditions before you leave home. And if you must travel, please pack an emergency supply kit. Uh, you can keep up to date with the latest forecasts and conditions as the storm progresses throughout the weekend. You can interact with us on social media, either through Facebook or Twitter, or visit our website at weather.gov FSD. Thank you for your time, and please stay safe this weekend.